hey man, first I want to say thanks. I bought your course some time ago and being a pervert got me the best compliment I could ever dream of. She looked at me straight in the eyes, gave me a hug, and told me I was the best sex she's ever had. You're free to use the testimonial. Nice, thank you, Jake. I've always been perverted, but your course allowed me to break the chains of shame and prudeness, which has greatly improved my confidence in sex. Now the question is fairly simple, but a frustrating topic. If I am fucking... I hammer the hell out of a lady and treat her like an object, which makes them come quite easily. But when I get them on top, I usually lose my erection. I don't know why, as I eat pretty healthy, lift weights at the gym around two to three times my body weight. Don't drink much alcohol nor smoke at all, please advise. In a nutshell, I get good quality erections, but I lose the erection only when the woman is on top. What the fuck? That is a thing called venous leakage. So, uh, the way your blood, the way your like your arteries work, is they have these kind of like flaps, I guess you could say, which lock the blood uh, in one direction. It keeps the blood flowing in one direction rather than going backwards the way it came in. So, basically, uh, when you have these, when the venous locks. In your, in your veins are weak, they'll, they'll flap or like or come down a little bit and the blood can go back in and out the same, the same way. The blood can go backwards the same amount it's going inwards basically. So when you're on top, you're fighting gravity. Or so when she's on top rather, you're fighting gravity. Um, so this is more prevalent, it's more noticeable when a woman's on top. So I would, to me this sounds like a clear cut case of venous leakage. So you will want to supplement with a thing called horse chestnut extract. You can, people buy this for varicose veins, but just get a simple, get a bottle of that off of Amazon and uh, take the daily dosage that they prescribe on that. And within a couple of weeks, you should be back to normal. There you go.